Yo, what's happening glider riders? Welcome to my channel and welcome to the video where I'm taking you down the most dangerous trail system in Cape Town. Some of you might be watching this video and like, what the f is he on about? This trail is super easy. What's going on here? How can this trail be so dangerous? What's up with that? More people get medevaced out of here than any other trail here in Cape Town. I've even heard that the local private hospital has renamed their MRI machine after this trail system. In fact, I've actually been there while someone has broken his neck and got medevaced out. I've also even scraped someone off the trail that was concussed. The guy even got upset with me and all aggro and wanted to fight. Here's a pro tip. When people are trying to help you, don't get f***ing aggressive with them. We are a few hundred meters from the parking lot now and about to enter the single track. This is a high speed segment and considered a danger zone because lots of people crash here. Let's pause this video for a moment. I'm gonna be straightforward with this. If you happen to ride with clipless pedals and you have no skills, you should change to flats. You have no business riding clipless pedals if you have no mountain biking skills. This is the A-frame bridge. It's around about five foot high. People get on here and they get really nervous with clipless pedals and they try to unclip and they can't unclip in time and it's a big mess. There are a few of these A-frame bridges here on the trail system, so be aware of that. I have to apologize for the shaky footage here. I am riding with the camera in my hand so the footage did come out a bit shaky. Are you, that, are you the guy from Ride? Get it right, 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 get it right. Get it right. Get it right. Get Enjoy, man. This is the cool section, flowy and a bit fast and takes you into a few whoops in the gully. After that little fun section you get into the climb which is a bit of a pig and by the time you get to the top here you will be tired. This climb is tough for the majority of the people and there are plenty of people walking and there's no shame in getting off your bike gear and walking up the rest of it if you do struggle. Once you're at the top, you're greeted with this trail right here, which is the Cobra Trail. It's a controversial topic. It's rated black, which it is not. It is more like a blue trail to me. Nothing on this trail is black and all the features are off to the sides of the trail. So you don't need to ride any of the small features that are on this trail. A bit of a start there. And it's good. Should be in good condition now. Little jumps there, little kickers, all like the small features on this trail, whatever they are, are all on the sides of the trails. Yeah, There's nothing on the main line, everything is just off to the side. And everything is super small, so I don't know why this is classified as a, a black trail, super peddly. Huge shout out to my Patreons, you boos are amazing. If you aren't a Patreon yet and you want to support and help the channel out, head on over to my Patreon account, link in the video description below. It's also gonna pop up on the corner of the screen. There you'll get early releases, bonus content, and you'll join the inner circle. Nice pretty flowers out now because it's springtime. Which is pretty great. I think you
and it is quite boring to ride. I think I've ridden this many times on a cross country bike and it's still not that much like fun to ride because it is just so pedally. I mean if pedaling's a thing you'd have maybe an average amount of fun going down here but other than that it's actually pretty boring. That's the view from the bottom. Once you have finished riding the Cobra, you are greeted with another climb, which is a little bit easier than the first one. You should take it easy up here because you will be needing your energy for the next descent, which we are going to be entering now. This is the first descent as we enter the Walfe Genoeg Loop. Windy. Whoa. <laughs> Smash that rock. Good thing I got alloy rims. Yeah, my wheel is getting a bit flat. Sliding a bit at the back here. I'm gonna take my back wheel. The red button. Well, uh, God, I see a thing there. Oh, what? Wow, someone, yeah. Oh, hey. How's it? Thank you. Maybe partly a reason why people crash here. What does it look like here? Oh, it's fine. I like that one, that one's red. Now remember I told you to take it easy on the previous climb and keep some gas in the tank? Well, this is where you're gonna be needing it. The liaison from here to the next descent is quite long. If you are out here during springtime or summer, it gets pretty hot out here, there's no water available and the last bit of the climb before you get to the descent called Patrick's Plunge is a bit of a pig.
speed up a bit more. Once you're done with this descent, you're gonna have to dig in deep and use what's remaining in that gas tank of yours to get you back to the final descent idea. of the day. The last liaison to that descent is the longest of the day and pretty much uh, the most boring one. So I cut it out and I skip straight to the descent, which is the fastest and the most fun descent on this trail. This final descent will lead you back to the start of the trail and to the parking lot. Good times go bad. This is also the part of the trail that is considered more dangerous than the others. So if you do go down here, beware and be careful. It gets really fast towards the bottom. It's kind of like a speedway. So just be prepared to pick up a lot of speed. Well, apparently me neither. <laughs> If you do happen to have some mechanical on your bike or get a puncture, there is a bike shop at the bottom here with a coffee shop as well. So you can grab a cup of coffee after your ride. Punch that like button if you like the video. Subscribe if you like my channel. Hit the bell to be notified every time I drop a video. Like, share and leave a comment in the comment section below. I will catch you on the next episode.